Mary's Missionary Church. As a place of happiness, a place of grace, a place of worship, a place of salvation. I greet you all in the name of Jesus Christ. I was here in May. For four months, I've been having a problem in my stomach. So, Friday, on Friday, I bought this book of Life of a Victorious Christian. So, when I got home, where I have visited, chapter I opened one chapter, I read it. Then after after reading it, I prayed. Then I took the book. As they have said, or just command. Or in all or so that, that what is happening must come out. I took the book. I put it on my stomach. I slept on top of it. And then I kept on saying. You who have blocked my life, come out. Come out. Come ten minutes. After ten minutes, my body was shaking like Colostina. My body was shaking like a Constantina. Then I then realized where I'm sleeping. They don't know the church I'm going to. Where I am sleeping, it's not even my home. The miracle that I was seeing at that time, I'm going to see problems in this house. I took this book and I put it aside. But and I continue to thank God for my healing. Even now, even now, I am free. And the, I met the servant of God one-on-one. -on -one. And I thank God that I gave him my letter that I had wrote in a picture frame with my prayer request as I am beginning my ministry in 2016. When he prayed for me after I went everything changed. I found my wife and my daughter, they were sick. And the, the moment I stepped there, I told them that when I come back, everything is going to change in our family. My child was feeling very old and I gave her the anointing water. Oh. Same time, she developed rash, rash and she developed, she, she sweat and the following day she was fine. And my wife, who was sick, he took the anointing water and put under the pillow. My wife the following day in the morning she was fine thank you the if he can hear the pastor that was giving a testimony he came one on one you remember we have can you go and take his things there I put them in the office there I said until he come back to give us a testimony. Is then I will throw them away. Where is that pastor? Where? Come, pastor. After I saw him one on one, I said, God, this man, he humbled himself. I won't throw these things. 
I'll put them here in my office. When I reach there, when I look at them, do something. So now he has given me a testimony. And then it's a testimony of healing because everybody was sick in the house. Everybody. This man could not save money. Automatically, he's supposed to go around searching for healing. Are you hearing me? Searching for help. There was no way. But he gave me those frames there. I put them there. I said, God, no, this is over. This man is trouble. He's a pastor. So now I will never allow them, this thing, to leave my office until he come back. And where did you come back? Uh, to, uh, where did you come for one-on-one? -on -one? On the 13th. 13th of what? Last month. 13th September. Can you see 13th September? And now, which day today? Can, eh? Four. If you can calculate, he says, when you went back, when you went back, this happened, this happened, this happened. It never took time. I think uh, it's, we are not in the time of Daniel now. We are in the time of Jesus Christ. Daniel fasted 21 days. He carried on with fasting. We are not in the time of Daniel, eh? We are in the time of what? Of Jesus Christ now and the Holy Spirit. So bring them. You can see what he gave me there. He put them in a frame. All his problems. You can see them there. Just look at that. That's what he gave me. I never throw it. I never throw this. And this is, I'm sure, the name of his ministry. And always I say, God of mercy. Remember this man. And today is happy. Very happy. And when you prayed for me, man of God, uh. I, I started to, to dream. Even this morning, I dreamt I was with you. You were let, teaching me things. Let me sit down. Carry on. You say what? This morning, I was even telling my wife, uh, I started to dream. Since when I left here, I started to dream things, and the things come to happen. This morning, I was with you the whole night, and you were teaching me things. I was here. I was following you, and you were putting on a white suit. I, I, I even wrote it on my diary here. And uh, the day before yesterday... That's, that's why I'm sitting down. I'm afraid to fall, to faint. <laughs> Say it again. And yesterday, uh -huh. day, I was uh, with uh, Prophet uh, T.P. Joshua putting uh -huh. on a white suit. This uh -huh. morning, I was with you putting on a white suit. You were walking with me and I was following you. So the time I came here, you just hold my chest. Because when I wanted to come here, I had a pain here. The devil didn't want me to come through. So I had a sharp pain. But the moment you put your hand in my chest, uh -huh. that sharp pain ended. Because I had fear, again to say now, for the ministry. But the day you prophesied me in the office there, I have strength. And now I, I feel I can do it because I gave you that... Uh, a picture frame with my vision that I saw and you began to tell my name and uh, my two children. So that vision had eaten me for the past 15 years. But when I saw you, things are beginning to change and I can feel that I'm, I'm about to do the work of God to evangelize. Oh, I told you about your two children. You told me about my two children. I brought one. Uh, Shama and uh, Sia Grino. I mentioned them. You mentioned their names. I say what? Well. You said, uh, God, you said, I, I, I can see two children, Shama and Sia Grino. Then I said, Sia Grino, and God, see, you said yes. So you can see how God has done for you. Mighty works are coming. So, so it's a serious case. I, I, I was crying all the time that when I'm going to get a father. And when I brought that picture frame, I was at the back there praying. When I saw the other pastor when we were registered, I said, ah, I want the servant of God to touch, to, to, to take uh, this picture frame. And when yes. I saw the, saw the pastor, the pastor said, ah, 
don't worry about the picture frame. I ran there and began to pray again and said, no, this picture frame, the servant of God, he must take it. The servant of God must take this picture frame. So I had to carry it even when the pastor had said, no, don't worry about the picture frame. But when I prayed, I said, no, there are many people going there. So I was busy also praying, saying, no, before I go there, I don't want the prophet of God to be tired. So I was busy praying at the back. So until I go there and he is going to receive my picture frame. So I just tried it when I went there. I said, servant of God, when you finish praying for me, servant of God, I have got my picture frame with my vision that God showed me 15 years ago. Then uh, inside me, I was believing that if he is going to take it, my problems are over. Then... If we can have faith like of this man, ah, then all, this, the, all this, things will go well. The servant of God, he say, I even wrote it on another picture frame. I wrote it, I put it in my house. Yeah. That the vision for the past 15 yeah. years was confirmed by the prophet. And I wrote it and his words. He said it two times, said, I will take it. I will take it. And I wrote it with the red words. I will take it. I will receive it. Then I had joy such that I was just waiting for the cars to take us. Then I take my car. I go back to my house with the joy. When I came there, my wife knew it that things have changed. You can hear what this man is saying. I, thank you, sir. Go and sit down. And uh, you know when, when I was sleeping here, I saw something like yours. Uh, I saw one pastor called, I'm sure he's a new pastor here. In this pastor here called Palati. Can you stand up? White in complexion. Palati. Are you Palati? Yes. Uh, you have the same thing like this man. You are, are you coming here for the first time? Yes. Eh? Yes. So there's something that you've been writing, you want to see. It will be happening in your life. So God was telling me about uh, even this palace, I will raise him. Thank you. God wants to raise you. you. Because I'm just hearing Sutu. It's like, you speak Sutu? Yes. Eh? Yes. Palace, God wants to use you to reach many people. Thank you. So God said, you must not look at your situation because Many times when you look at your situation, you question if you are truly called or not. Is it not true? Amen. Eh? It's true. So God has called you and he wants to bless you. Your blessing is coming. Thank you. These are people that have been undermined that God normally chooses them and use them. Because God does not go by our pride. You hear what I'm trying to say? God does not go by what? By our pride. God, you have got his own pride. So, when I was looking at that one, when my brother was talking, God says to me, can you see this man? I will use him. He must know because he brought, it's God who brought you here. It's God. So, it's tough in the ministry. Now, very, very tough. The way God... Eh? It's true. Eh? Yes, it's true. Sometimes you said, ah, it's like, did I call myself here? Or, <laughs> or it's God who called me? <laughs> what what is, is happening with you? Can you see when you, people come to church, <laughs> next week you don't <laughs> see them? <laughs> ah. you, you have many questions. <laughs> eh? Amen. Can you explain to me, my brother, what yes. is happening there? Carlos, yeah, sometimes people are coming, sometimes they don't come. And I'm, I'm working hard to, to save the people. But sometimes they just vanish. Then I find myself with a few people. If you can hear his voice, you hear that this guy has been praying his voice is this man doesn't speak like this, but because of 
the strife and the struggle. I want to encourage you, my brother, that uh, whatever God does, no man can understand it. God, God wants to raise you when people are rejecting you. Already there is anointing. Let me touch your chest there. I'm touching your chest. Yeah. Lift Amen. up your hands and you receive this anointing. Amen. Take it in Jesus' name. Amen. Take in Jesus' mighty name. You are anointed. Amen. Amen. Where is your husband? Can you stand up? Uh, because I see you crying alone. Yes. Yes, sir. Huh? yes, man of God. It's like always you say, why is like no one sees me? Yes, man of God. Because you do good, but nobody check it. That is the last week, you will begin to say it's better you go away from people. Last week in America, I want to be part of the You don't want to be part to anybody. It's better you just live your life. That is true. Huh? That is true. God says, don't do that. There's a way forward. He, he want to bless you. I'm still seeing a tall man. But that God is bringing to your side. There's there there still a marriage in your life. Come on, come on, come on. What's okay? Which friend? The one, the tall brother. Oh, my tell you, like this. Friend. Yes. Who's Mpo? Kemang It's uh, her Mpo. father. That's my uncle. Yes. Huh? That's my uncle. My dad's brother. Your dad, where is he? At work. Uh, we need to pray for him. Eh? Yeah, because of what he's facing. Eh? So sometimes he feels like it's better he leave the job. Did he tell you? Yes, he told me that. Eh? He told me that next day he wants to go into ministry. Let him come ministry. to me. I will tell tell him him even if he's going to the ministry, he must not resign very fast. Because ministry is not part of place. Ministry as we You need to hear God. It's so, but it's true God has called him. Because I see a man like this. Yes. Eh? So to you, it's like a friend to you. You are very close to you. Yes. Eh? Yes. So God bless you. Can you stand up? Uh, I saw you pray, my brother, and you must carry on praying. God will bless you. I saw you yesterday when you were praying. Usually you love to pray late. Eh? You know God is looking on your prayers. And because there was a problem that you were struggling with. Especially financially. Amen. Things are very, 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 very tough. Eh? But I'm here because I want to use this man mm. to bring a change in the family. You, you are going to succeeded in a way that people of the family will depend on you. Mm. So don't look at your problems. Eh? So Where is your boyfriend? Boyfriend, I didn't say husband. I said boy. boyfriend. Did I say boyfriend? It's your boyfriend. Yes, sir. Eh? Yes, yeah, boyfriend. Yeah. Eh, so I'm boyfriend. right. Eh? Oh, he's, my eh? he's my husband. I'm not right. Where is your boyfriend? Boyfriend, my husband. He's your husband, but you people here, you don't respect each other. So, can you see boyfriend and girlfriend how they live? Boyfriend and girlfriend, This marriage has been attacked. You must respect your husband so that he must love you. Always argument. Nothing becomes very big. That's how Satan is penetrating the marriage oh, to stop progress. People are struggling too much. Huh? True. You say true. Why when I talk about struggle, you don't say true? Why Fighting. Eh? 
thought it was normal for married people. Nigeria mutongo kintu asitoi idimo ba tumbao ni ala. You say what? I thought it was normal for married people. Nigeria kintu asitoi idimo ba tumbao ni ala na ba no kahan. Can you hear that? Liangua. She says normal. Mare kisitoi idimo kintu au toile. Normal to married people. So God loves so you. So humble yourself. It is not normal. A wife is normal when you humble yourself. It's normal for husband when he loves you. That is normal. To a Christian. Amen. And also normal for you to be delivered. And they are picking normal when you look low. You see, normal. Can you see what is normal? Why will I not normal? Be normal. Be normal. Be normal when I come on. In Jesus' name. Amen. She's free. Look at her. God has healed you. Let me see what you are wearing here. Why you, why you wear this and you cover it this way? Why you wear it and you cover? Why you wear it and you cover? God has healed you. Closing it. You, you are, I will tell you for what. You, you are developing arthritis. And this is the disease of the family. Yes. You people, when you reach 60, yes. the, the disease will become so strong. Yes. Even walking yes. becomes a problem. Yes. Huh? Yes. It's true. Yes. So you won't face that. Because yes. yes. so Jesus has healed you. Yes, over for this. Come. Come. I want to see this. Come. I want to see. Come. 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 Leave that pregnant. Leave. Oh. Leave this pregnant. Leave this pregnant. Come on. Out. Can you leave this stomach? Okay, look at the body. You can look at the legs there. The legs there. You can see that the whole body has been attacked. You can look at the attacking. That's, that thing is leaving the stomach. There's, they There's a snake. <laughs> they, they put a snake here. <laughs> God loves you. <laughs> Where do you stay? <laughs> Where were you staying before? <laughs> uh? I'm coming from Makado Venda. I need to pray for you. <laughs> because of, I mean, this is poverty. When people look at you, they think you have got money. Yeah, so, uh, always they ask you money. Deep, deep down, you say, uh, why? Because you are not rich. Yeah. Deep down, you are not rich. Yeah. Deep down, you are not rich. So, God must bless you today. Uh, I wanted to help, it's true. Yeah. Uh, I wanted to help, it's true. I have a lot of problems I need help. That's why I say I don't know you. I say stand up here. I want to pray for you. Jesus will help you. Nobody can help you. I know. Amen. Funny. You got a job.
Get a breakthrough. I receive. Get a breakthrough. I receive. Let me hear this one. You say never, you say what? No. no. Can we get another No. Uh -huh. no. no. I say no. Can I get Every day watching Makaranisa day and night. Time to die, sleep, and work to see Makaranisa. Why? Never. Why? Never. Why? Makaranisa never. Makaranisa is my grandfather. Makaranisa is my grandfather. Never. 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 My grandfather doesn't know Jesus. I'm surprised you are calling my grandfather. So, I'm calling my grandfather. So, I'm calling my grandfather. It's only Jesus who's the Savior. What, what are you doing? You know? Not everything for that guy. Uh -huh. That guy who pray always. He loves God, that guy. I never brought I never said. Since last week. Since last week. I said, I said the channel of uh, of of Magalini, sir. Since 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 since. <laughs> Oi. He never, said the channel never. of Makarani. You said Makarani always. Makarani is always. You want? You want to say Charis TV? When you go to Charis TV. Why? Why? Is he watching Charis TV? No. Why? 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 Can you tell me two things you are blocking number one? Finances, uh -huh. marriage. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So who are you? Who is blocking? I'm spirit of anger. You're spirit of anger. Yes. yes. And then another one? That guy. Oh, you're only spirit of anger. That guy. So let me touch it, the head. Ah, in Jesus' name. Hey, 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 why you say I hey, no, 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 no. Every day Makaranis, every day Makaranis. Every day Makaranis. Why, why, why you watch Jerry every day? I'm cutting your why head. Why you watch him every day? You are why? defeated in why? Jesus' name. That guy badly stand for me. That guy badly stand. Even I, I come and if anything. Or badly still, why she? Or badly still, why did she go fell? She's Never. owning a lot Never. of people. It's this me who's one. doing it. You see that money? This one. That this is the last one for This is the last ten rand he's having. Today only. This is the last money he has. Okay. You know what? Man, you. This is the last man. He, he gave it. This is the last man. This is the last man. Is he money. giving it? Why uh, Nick Lauro and Janjan? Today. Is he giving this money? I, is he giving it? Answer me. I offer him that money. Eh? I offer him that money. Who? That guy. Eh? That guy. He's offering the money. Yeah, yeah he's uh, offering the money. So, can you give me the money? I'm taking yeah. it. Yeah. Don't take that money, please. Don't take that money, please. Don't take that money, please. I took it. No, please. I have it now. Can I leave or not? No. I took it. Please. 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 In Jesus' name. Ay, 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 my Don't take that money, please. Already I took it. This brother next week will be giving us a brother testimony. Brother next week will be giving us a testimony. Brother next week will be giving us a testimony. And you, what is there now? What? It's ay, another money. Ay, it's the last money for that guy. The last, the last money. Last money. Last money. Last so you can go. Let me cut your head. You can go now. Ay, 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 ay. Yo, money. Please. Take that money, please. Let me cut no, your head again. Please, please. 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 Oh, please. please. In, in Jesus. Because you take that money, that guy, you got to reach. Hey, if you take the guy. money, you'll be rich. It's going to be rich. Yeah. I block everything for that guy. Okay, so let you do check Who came with him? Who came with him? Who came with him? You don't know him. God has blessed this man today. In Jesus' name. Leave him, leave him. Tell you that yeah. he's the 
grace of God that has brought you here. Hallelujah. God told me that he wants to use your hand. Hallelujah. To my surprise, not this hand, Pastor. Aile. This one. Le. Because I saw you laying hands on people yes. with left hand. Yes. Yeah? yes. So God wants to use that hand. Amen. Don't withdraw. Uh, not that he can't use the right, but God, I must tell you that he has deposited healing Amen. upon your life. So you must heal the people of God. Eh? Don't look at this. Challenges come to those who are called. Yes. Amen. So stand firm. Amen. Where is your wife? Come. Even your wife, she's sick. So yeah, I know of that. You know? Yes. So you are the first person to lay hands on your wife. Can you lay hands on your wife? She'll be healed now. Yes. Pastor, why is like nothing is happening? Come to me, Pastor. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Pastor, don't do this thing again. Eh? Come here. Come. Come. Stand and lift up your hands. Close your eyes. Go and lay hands now. Lay hands. Lay hands. Can you see now? After he has been prayed for. Lay hands. Pastor, the way you are laying hands, I'm not happy. Because you... you you won't pray only for your wife. You are going to pray for the other lady. You must lay hands on her. Even yourself. Take it. Take it. Stand up, Pastor. Pastor, fall down again. Fall down again. So stand up very fast. Go and lay. Hey, hey, hey Pastor, hey. I clap hands for my Pastor. All right. Lay hands here, she will receive now. Amen. Uh -huh. Do it again. Uh, you can hear the noise there. Ah! He could not deliver his wife unless he has been prayed for. So you can hear the demon there in his wife. Pastor, touch your blood. You are blessed now. Amen. Uh -huh. So, don't greet me again that way. Pastor. Pastor, the moment you shake, the moment you shake a man like this, and you do like this, you see, Pastor? You see there, Pastor? <laughs> so, you're blessed. Amen. There's fire entering you. You, you feel it? Yes. Huh? <laughs> Is a pastor who came with him? No one knows him. Stand up, pastor. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Go on to annoy this man. You know him? I came with him. He's, he's called Matlangu. You know he's a pastor. But, but this man is suffering. God told me things are very hard for him. You, you know them? How do you know them? They are members of my church. They are members. You people must support this man. And also tell other people in the church. Eh? Amen. And then I'm praying for him now. He is going to have a solution of the whole church. Amen.
So your pastor is anointed now. So. Amen. Come, you are healed. Come. You are healed. Eh? Amen. When I, I Did you go to the doctor? I, I came to the apostle. Eh? I came to the apostle and he. So God has you. healed you. I thank you, Jesus. Where is your husband? He's late. Eh? He's late but you are still seeing him. Eh? Yeah. I can't hear you. Yes, I am. Because God says you are failing to move forward in life because of what has happened. Yes, eh? yes it's true. The family is accusing. They are talking against you. So just forgive so everybody. You hear me? Yes. Come. And you were talking together before I came here. Yes. Eh? Yes. Why, what were you saying? I was telling her that the prophet will talk to her. Eh? I was telling her that she has to listen to your message because it's what she has been telling me all the way from Botswana. No, she's complaining. Yes. Eh? yes. She's complaining. She said, she said, Hi. My situation won't change. Exactly. Eh? Exactly. exactly. That's what she told me all the way from Botswana. She was telling from all the way from Botswana. Yes. But I don't know her. I just met her. Where do you come from? I come from Botswana. She just met her. You, you have done very well to tell her. Yes. She doesn't know that God is watching her here. But I don't know her. Come. You are free. Come. coming to you. Hold him. God told me that this man is going to be a millionaire. Who came with you here? Because I'm seeing some people here. Where are they? You know what he's doing? Yes, I know. What is he doing? I think he's going to be a pastor. Yeah? I think he's going to be a pastor. This is not just a mere pastor. Yes. I know that. Eh? We noticed that. Eh? We noticed that. God will be speaking with this man. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Leave him. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You know when I'm seeing this, so I'm seeing God anointing this man in front of me. Let's give him a ring. I see God anointing this brother. Hold him, hold him. What he's doing to me is not new.
God is raising me as a prophet. Amen. Well, thank you for anointing him in Jesus' name. Leave him down there. Leave him, leave him. If you remember when Saul met Samuel after he turned, <inaudible> the dance he was dancing. You remember? And, and people say, Ah, is Saul among the prophets? <inaudible> uh, So, so you can look at his face. Uh, where, where, where is the family? You look at his face. Even when he's speaking in tongues, some of you are touched, eh? eh? Listen to his tongues, put him, I hold him there, hold him. Can you see? Watch, watch. Sit Can you praise God wherever you are? Thank you for anointing this man today. Amen. In Jesus' name. I greet you in the mighty name of Jesus. I came here in May. I couldn't sleep at night. I had arthritis. One time when I was scrolling across the channel, I came across Charis TV. I started being bothered in my spirit. At the other day on a Saturday, my sickness got worse. I hunted this place until I found it. it. I remember I was seated on that side of the sick people. My apostle prayed for me. When I went back home, the arthritis was finished. Amen. And then his second testimony, I'm a pastor. I was ordained 2004. There was something in me when I was always preaching. I prayed, I preached hard. There was a snake inside After of me. After that, I would run outside. I would take that snuff too much and I would hide it so that people can not see me. How can I preach when I'm holding the snuff? The other day when I was here, Apostle prayed for me. I left the snuff at home. When I got in Marabastat, the snake said, you are buying me and you must smoke me. <laughs> And I took it too much. When I got home, the apostle was preaching on TV. I put the snuff on top of the TV. I said, you snuff today. I'm tired of you. I'm leaving you here. Since June. 
Till today. I'm no longer taking the snow. And even when I preach, I no longer hold my host like that. I'm preaching freely. I thank the God of Charis. Amen. <laughs> Come, this brother, come, you. Yes, where is your wife? Can you bring your wife? Uh, where are you coming from? Uh, Pretoria. Pretoria. Yeah. Go watch your not you people. You people. <laughs> because you are here for impartation. So God said, I must pray with you. Uh, mm -hmm. Can you touch your chest? Leave your wife, touch your chest. All of you fall. Fall. You are anointed, all of you. All of you here fall. Here, yeah, fall, fall, fall. Here, yeah, fall. Hey, all of you. All of you here. Hey, fall. I'm seeing which is like short lady. Uh, lady pastor. Yes. You've passed lady. Where is your church, Mama? Huh? KZN Msinga. Huh? KZN Msinga. KZN Msinga. So this lady, she's struggling too much. Yeah, you have done everything. You can't change that place. Because these people are, don't even believe in you. You are, you are just struggling there. But now you start to pray with these people. I see some people pregnant. Others, they want children. Others, they've got pregnant for a long time. And there's a problem there that I'm seeing. That people are struggling there. Eh? Yeah. You are together. Yes. So you people here, God is blessing you. Amen. He's blessing you today. You will pray with these people. <laughs> this mama, another reason I'm calling her because she's sick. Always, always this heart problem. <laughs> that is like beating fast. Like <laughs> can make her to fall down. Do you know, do you know what I'm talking about? Do you know what I'm talking about? Sir? Yes. Sir. Uh, she told you. Yes. So she's healed. So my opinion, you are healed. One brother here, here. here. you behind, come on, around. Yeah, this one with tie. Come, it's a Brother, from now, God will show you who is your wife. Yes, because you have been crying to Mary, but there's no way. Amen. Is it true? Yes, sir. So God will show you. Because you, you love to pray. You love to, to follow God with all your heart. But, but it's difficult to marry because of the idol of the family. You are separated with that idol. Amen. Go and show your wife. How old are you now? Are you falling? Okay, you are blessed. Amen. Visitor, but I saw you. 
I saw you worry so much that are you coming for the first time? as a visitor, yes I saw you worry, asking God why why must my situation is not changed it's true and I saw the family go away from you it's true, man of God eh? it's very true everybody has rejected you it's true, it's true, man of God. God. You, you know what I'm talking about yeah. Yeah. Eh? yes, this is my wife and it's true what you are saying it's it's true. True. But, uh, family is rejecting us and things are not Working according Can I tell you? Don't cry for the family. Let them go. Amen. God wants to bless you. They will Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm seeing the family will search for you. Thank Thank you cry. Others, others will come and ask forgiveness. Because God told me that they never approved your marriage. Is it not true? It is true. Eh? It's true, man of God. They never approved this. Even today, they are still not approving it. Amen. That is why they are going away from that is why you. Because, because they know you are in stagnation. Yes. Things are tough. Yes. Tough. tough. The moment they look at you, they Can think you back there. Yes. So, don't worry, God is raising you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. God wants to fight for you. God wants to fight for you people. Yeah. It is your time now to see what God can do for you. Thank you hear what I said? Yeah, eh? yes, yes. It is the time now. You'll be able to hold money like others. Thank you, Pastor. Because Thank you, Pastor. Whatever you plan, you plan out of nothing. But I see God providing. So people will look at you and admire you. But tell them it's Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen. 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 You are receiving money as I'm standing here. You are receiving money as I'm standing. Amen. As I'm standing here, take it. Take it. Take it. Take it. Amen. Take it, take it. it. You're blessed. You're blessed. I greet you in the name of Jesus Christ. I'm here to thank God who has healed me. I had TB. I greet you in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I'm here to thank God of Papa and Mama. I'm here to thank the God of Apostle and Mama. I came here as a visitor previously. I was having a challenge of my daughter. My daughter was delivered here. I brought her here for deliverance. So after she started to progress at school because she was not progressing. I came, I came with her result for the first time. She passed all the subjects. And even now she qualified to write another five subjects. She qualified for five subjects again. So, God is so great. I'm here. I came here from Pumalanga just to give this testimony. That, that which is impossible to man is possible with our God. Amen. Hallelujah. that 
I saw there. The one there, the brother. Yes, the brother. Where is your wife? Mama, okay. Call your wife. I want you to go home and dance. You people. I wish you can dance a song. That one that Mama sing. Since I met Jesus. Since I met Jesus, I like to Jesus. Since I met Jesus, my life has changed. Because God is changing your life, you people. There was in your wife something that pissed her womb. She was always telling you. Yes, it's true. Huh? Yes, it's true. And this thing here, it has been set from small age. to feel this. Yes. Now it's growing with her. Yes, it's true. I'm sure she told you. Many a times, yeah. Huh? Yes. So they just like put her in a cage. So, and I heard that whoever will marry this lady, if she's not delivered, will suffer. Yes, but, but you are also facing the same thing they said. You're always facing struggles, struggles. Struggle. Yes, I lost so many things, men of God. Huh? I lost so many things. I want to tell you, you need to go home and dance. Because this thing has been removed. I receive. You are free. You can even ask her how she feels. Because always she will be feeling something pressing her. Ask her how is she feeling now. I'm not feeling the pain now. Because it's over. It's like you are married twice. The way I'm looking at you. They came and paid over. The problem came. The second time, the pain of the problem came. It's like it's several times. Come forward here. Because there's a snake that I'm seeing. That is fighting you not to get married. Can you come forward? Where is the lady I'm talking about? Come. Can you tell us how many times? Because to me, I'm seeing people coming to pay the problem. Huh? Twice. Twice. Yes, I've been married twice. Twice. And now, even now, you're alone. Yes, yes. Huh? It's true, man of God. It's because true. what I'm seeing is like this is snake. Yes. Even you, know. you, when you sleep here, you see a snake. It's true, huh? it's true man of God. Because you are married by a snake. Yes, it's true. Huh? It's true. I've seen the snake in the even, yesterday. Even yesterday. Even yesterday. Yes. Yes. Yeah, because by me coming here, this snake doesn't want you to be visible. No, I, 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 yes, it's true. Eh? It's true, Even when you are in the church here, you feel bored. Yes. Isn't that true? It's true. It's because true. of this, it's like the snake will be working against you. Working no, against I, 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 Everything is shattered. Eh? God. Everything, even my business is not working. Even your business. Yes. Yes. You are married, my sister. You are disconnected today. Come on, you snake. Demon! Out! 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 Demon! It's over. It's over. Leave it down. There. There is something you saw, you dream someone dead, but you saw yourself in the coffin. You've been dreaming dead people, but this dream, you began to know that you are the one who will follow now. Can you come? I want to pray for you because people are dying in your family. Don't hide, come forward. I want to pray for you. We need to stop funeral. Come forward. Come forward. The brother that I'm talking about, come forward.
Brother, people are dying in your family. Yes, even, 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 even men of God, even two weeks back, we were burying my uncle. Two weeks and back, of late, of late, I've been dreaming my past, uh, my dad was passed away and my brother was passed <inaudible> away. Brother, Papa. you know, it's God who brought you here. Yes, I think two, three weeks back, I can confirm that. Two, three weeks back, I heard a voice saying, go and see Apostle Makananis. Because if you didn't come here, I don't I want to talk about that. if, but, but because you are here, Amen. we have stopped funeral. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Come on. Come on. You are free. Come on. Come on. Amen. You demon of funeral. It's like he's coming out from the grave. This Look at him there. What are you doing in him? What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? Speak. What do you want to kill him? I can't hear you. I can't hear you. Huh? Come on. Come on, you demon. Out. Jesus, mighty name. Let him stand. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. It's freedom. You are free. Look, look, hey. And he never thought, he never thought you've got a demon. Is it not true? That's true, man of God. So you are That's even surprised how you are shaking. Amen. So it's a demon that has left you. You are free from it. Amen. 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 Behind in my visitors. The brother here. Yes. God wants to deliver you. Mm. You are coming here for the first time. I've come once last year. I saw a spiritual wife that is behind you. Jesus. And I'm hearing God, I want to use this man. Are you a pastor? I'm not, but so many times I pray for people. They you, got delivered. Go on to use it, but I'm seeing this spirit try to attack you. Even Even right right now, now, huh? Since last Friday, I've been very sick. I don't know what is wrong with me. Since the doctors doctor test everything, alone. they couldn't find it. No one can find any doctor, disease in you. Alone. You're no doctor. Even it's an doctor. attack. It's an evil attack. Yeah, attack. <laughs> God is delivering you, sir. Come on. Come on. Come on, you demon. What are you doing in him? Can you hold him? What are you doing there? The demon. What are you doing? Huh? I can't hear you. Huh? It's a demon that I'm seeing. What are you doing there? Demon oh. Fire. Oh. Fire. 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 Fire all over your body. Fire. What are you doing in him? Where is, where is his wife? Because even the wife is possessed. Oh. Can you lift your hands? You'll be delivered both of you at the same time. Amen. Come on! You demon! Leave this family. Ouch! Come on! Ouch! These people go on to use them. But this is a demon that is denying. Ouch! Come 
Urge. 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 After this, these people go and start to speak with them. Amen. Jesus mighty name. Amen. Leave him. He's free. Amen. He's free. But sister, you are free. You are free. Come Amen. here with your husband. Let me, let me bless you. Come here. Sometimes you find the wife is so tall. Like, like my brother is tall. Sometimes you find myself I'm thin. My wife is fat. Here you can see how God, uh, like I told you, there are different reasons which makes God special. When God chooses, He chooses. You can see my brother is thin like me and his wife is bush, uh, bashasha. So, come here. I want to anoint you. God said I must anoint you. Bring it. In Jesus' name. Amen. You are blessed, my brother. Go ahead and make it. No one will attack you. You see? The wife just do like this. It's like it's you, you and me. Can you see I'm fed? You are, you are thin. Come, come here. Come here. You are the husband. <laughs> You know, God works wonders. Uh, and uh, usually, <laughs> can you see there how God works? Ah. You know, I ask God, why this? Because uh, no, that's how it works. <laughs> you, you understand what I'm trying to say? Amen. You see, you see them the way. <laughs> sometimes, <laughs> sometimes if we go naturally, you can understand. <laughs> but you can see that this is the, the husband. I'm the wife here and I'm taller. And I'm telling. And the husband is falling down. The wife is not falling. That's And the husband, the, the wife just says, You are free. <laughs> That's how they are demonstrating me that. Uh, The wife must help the husband. So you need a wife like that one, that man. I, Amen. You need, you need a wife like that. Amen. Can you come here? Are you husband and wife? Come here. God is healing this lady. Come. You are healed. Because always when you sit, you get tired. Yes. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, I know. What makes you tired? I don't know. We were just fighting now. He says why I'm sleeping. Huh? You were fighting? I was yeah. complaining to say she was sleeping while the sermon was going on. She, she always, always sleeps. I said it's yeah. only demons who can do that. Even, even when you are watching, watching TV. Yes. Yes. She just goes like this. She sleeps. Yes. Huh? Yes. Mm. They make a week. Just, she just because it's not a character. She's a good woman. I will pray for her. Okay. This spirit will live her. Amen. You can see the spirit in her. Come on. Out. 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 Come out. After this, my brother, even yourself, you always say, sit down. Because she, God is going to give strength in her. She, she's going to be very active. Like yes. active good. She's free. And uh, the way she will be active. The way she will be active. Don't go to the doctor and think you are weak. Yes, Lord. <laughs> you hear what I said? Yes. So, because... The way she's going to be, if you won't. Short lady. Okay. 
a short lady. Come with your husband. You need a blessing from above. If not, whatever you do, you will fail. Because I saw, I saw where you were born, my brother. Where you were born, they don't believe in God. Amen. It's not true. Is it, it's true. Eh? It's true, man of God. So they used to call Sangomas to the house when he was small. There are some incisions they did on you which are working against you now. So lucky enough you have this lady. It's true, man of God. You must listen to this lady. It's true, man of God. Because there are people who are attacking this lady they say, why do you have a wise woman? That's true, man of God. Huh? That's very true, man of God. I mean your family. Yes. I'm talking about your family. Yes. So you know what I'm talking about. I know very well, man of God. God said to me, don't listen to them. Amen. Because he chose you. He wants to use you. He chose you. They say this lady is making you stupid. Is it not true, my sister? Can it? Huh? It's true. Because this lady wanted to go. Yes, that's huh? true. That's very true, man of God. She was saying, it's like I've got somebody <laughs> that I cannot say is my husband. That's very much true, man huh? of God. 100%, 100% true. No, God is blessing you, my brother. Don't <laughs> worry. You are free. I'm not praying for you. Yeah. Praise the Lord. <laughs> is there anybody who knows your problem? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Is yes. there any, uh, because yeah. I'm seeing some people that they, they say they even know what I'm talking about. Can you call them? Yes, Pastor Mahoko and, uh, and Come. my wife. Where are they? Pastor Mahoko. Because when we talk things here, you think we are doing guesswork. You know the problem we are talking? Yes. Yes. Uh, uh? yes. He was having a revival by my place. At our place. Uh, his, his wife was talking to him. I can't hear you. His wife told me during the week that she was planning to go and leave him, go, go and work in Mama Because nothing was coming together. Want to leave the husband? Yes. So God says to me, that's why I'm calling you people. Amen. That this man is your husband. Amen. Despite what the family is saying. Amen. Because, because you. To me, I blame my brother. I also blame you, my brother. You are listening to them. Isn't it not true? Amen. That's very true. Eh? Very, they, very they true. They are controlling you. By our control. Very so true. from today, stand with your wife. Thank you. Amen. Amen. You are, you are blessed. A brother there. There's a brother at the back there. Yes, I'm hearing something here. The brother at the back there. Yes, that brother. God loves you, my brother. God loves you. There will be no accident. There will be no accident in your life. Because devil is planning accident. Satan is planning accident. Are you hearing my brother? Yes, I'm hearing. Uh, what, do you have a car? Yes, I'm driving a quantum. What are you doing with quantum? It's a taxi. I say there is no accident. I want an accident. Yes, I Keep watching, Charis.